Hey friends, so I've been shopping and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so since fall is almost here, um, Dollar Tree has gotten in a lot of their fall items now. And so I went there the other day um, to see what they had. And actually I was a little bit late because a lot of the stuff had sold out. But um, I was going to show you some of the things that I picked up for fall. And the first thing is this pair of witch legs. I'm going to cut this tag off right here. But um, this is a door hanger. I thought it was really cute. I love witch themed stuff. But um, it hangs on your door and it's got this mesh up here. And the feet down here. And I got this. They had three colors, but I got it in the green and in the orange. They also had it in purple. But um, I picked these up because in the past, there has been many times that I could have used these when I was making some um, Halloween decorations. And um, these would have really came in handy if I had these back then. So I figured I would go ahead and pick them up. Um, I don't know if I, I might ha hang them on my doors for Halloween. But I wanted to go ahead and get them. That way I would have them in case I was ever making um, something for Halloween and I needed them. I've seen some really cute um, wreaths done for Halloween. Like with a witch theme where they had the hat on it. And then Halloween decorations, and then I thought these would be cute. They could be attached to that some kind of way. So I'm sure I'll get some good use out of that. And then the second thing that I picked up was these um, these bags of acorns. There's tw it's a 12 count bag. And um, I just thought they were really cute. You could do a lot of stuff with these. You could um, place them in a bowl. Um, Dollar Tree has some little bowls that are shaped in leaf shapes. You can um, pour some of these in there and they would make a cute fall decoration. Or you could fill um, vases with these. That would be cute. Or you could even add them on to wreaths that you may make for fall. You can, um, there's plenty of things you could do with those. And then also I picked up these pumpkin decorative picks. There's five in a pack. But um, these you can stick in flower arrangements. Um, you could also, I've seen people cut off the, um, the stick part of them and then they put them in wreaths or, um, you know, just different little things you could do with these. And then I also got two packs of these pumpkins that have the clips on the back of them. Um, these could come in handy on wreaths. Um, in flower arrangements, you can make a fall garland for your mantle. And um, you could clip these onto it. And um, these also come in a white color. And I actually wanted them in the white color because some of my house is in the farmhouse theme. And I thought the white colored um, pumpkins would kind of go good with that. But they didn't have any. They were sold out. So I just stuck with these orange ones and got those. And then I got these, um, they're kind of like burlap, but they have a shininess a little bit to them. And then they have the fall leaves on them. They have some glitter in them. But these would be cute too to add into a garland for your mantle on the corners. And they have the um, twist ties on the back. And then I picked up one of these. Now, Dollar Tree has these a lot of times every year, and they have some other ones. I forget what the other um, other one was, but this is called a placemat. Um, but the way I'm going to use it and the way I've seen people use it is um, I was watching a video the other day. I don't remember who it was, but the girl in the video, she took a piece of board and whitewashed it to kind of make it look old and rustic. And then she laid this on top of the board and she went in to all of these grooves 
with black paint and kind of stenciled the pumpkin onto it. And it turned out really cute. So I picked this up for that. But this would also be really cute to lay on a coffee table and, and to lay like some kind of um, fall arrangement in the middle or even a candy dish or even a bowl with the um, acorns like we were talking about. That would be really cute. Or you could even hang this up on the wall, actually. And then I found this sign. And it says, Gather Together. And I really like this because it has the farmhouse kind of uh, look to it. I thought this would go good with a lot of my decor. And I also found this sign. And it says, Pumpkin Kisses and Harvest Wishes. And this is a phrase that I've been seeing a lot for this fall. And now these come with the um, with the rope up top where you can hang them. But the way that I like to use these is I sit them on um, a easel or on a plate holder. And just let them prop up on, on one of those. That's the way I use these in my home. And then I found this cute little tin bucket with a scarecrow on the front. And I thought this was really cute. And I like to use these to put pins and different things in them. But I think what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to stick some foam down in it. And then I'm going to put some ribbon coming out and put some flowers down in it to make like a little fall arrangement. And I'm, I may set that on either my mantle or my coffee um, table. And I found this cute um, sparkly ribbon and I'm planning I saw a girl use this the other day I'm um, on a video and she had it coming out of um, her piece that she was making so I'm planning to have this running over the sides and then I bought these flowers these fall flowers now these I might use them in the um, little bucket that I'm gonna be making a, a little arrangement with but what I had originally bought these for was to take some of the flowers off to make to put on a wreath so I may have to go back and get some more flowers for one of those projects or I may be able to figure out a way to make it work I'm not planning to use a lot of these flowers for the wreath but I did get one each of these and Dollar Tree has a whole lot of big variety of fall flowers to choose from and I got this burlap ribbon also. I got uh, four of these. And I'll show you, like, there's many things you could do with this. I got four because you always need burlap ribbon laying around for different projects. But this was a great vine wreath that I had got. And I've already wrapped it with some of the, um, with some of the burlap. But I'm not finished yet. Like all of this is loose. And I'm going to hot glue it down. And I'm going to trim off all of these excessive um, pieces. Where it looks more like finished up here. And then I bought these galvanized um, words. They came three in a set. Hold on. I got too much stuff up here on my desk. And now I can't find my galvanized word. Well, there it goes. Hold on one second. <laughs> okay. So, I got this. Um, I don't know if this is going to show up the right way on camera, but it says harvest. Turn it that way and I'll turn it that way but it's like a galvanized metal and this is a three pack um, it also had the words blessed and thankful in it I've misplaced those right now though because I have a lot of stuff behind me of things that I'm working on right now so it's probably up under those this is the one I was going to use in this project and what I was going to do is I'm planning to put um, I'm a hot glue this across here 
and I don't know yet what I'm going to do. I may use some of these acorns, um, possibly a ribbon or some of these pumpkins that I have, and I'm going to glue them on there. And then I'm going to um, glue some of the flowers at the bottom. Um, so I think it'll be really cute. And then you can take, actually take this and glue it onto a um, picture frame. I've seen that done and that's really cute. But what I did, I just wrapped this burlap ribbon all around it. And the last thing that I have is these um, collapsible storage containers. I'm sure you've seen these at the Dollar Tree. Um, this is what I use in my craft room to store a lot of my um, items that I use. And it kind of keeps it organized and tidy. And this is not my craft room right here, okay? I'm in my office right now. And this is like a work area that I have. But um, this, I, I have bought many, many of these. And I continue to still buy them because I use these so much just to store stuff. And this is the larger size here. But you really can't beat that for only a buck. So this is my fall haul, guys. Um, if Whenever I make the projects for what I bought, I will do a video of them and show them to you. But um, be sure to check out the Dollar Tree, guys, because the items in there for fall are going really fast. And actually, they have out some of their Christmas items right now also. So go and be sure to check them out. And please give my video a thumbs up and please subscribe. Thank you. Have a good day.